Hello everyone, this is Everlasting and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be watching Bungo Stray Dog Season 2 Episode 6 now. Last episode we kind of had this kind of uh, battle against three uh, organizations, the uh, Guild and the Port Mafia as well as our very own detective agency and I'm really looking forward to seeing how they're gonna go with this because it seems like the Port Mafia already has a lead on where uh the detective agency president is. The the secret headquarters they're in now might just possibly be uh ambushed right anytime soon. So I'm really looking forward to what's gonna happen with this. Let's just start now. Oh, we have this. This is the the girl with the the guild member. What's your name? I don't think we got your name last episode. Oh, that's Reverend, right? Yeah, that's Reverend. They call him Reverend. <laughs> He's being silent. She's being silent. Oh. What happened? <laughs> Minister, okay. Minister. Okay. And to thus you will return. <gasps> You're using your ability against your own guild member. What? Okay. I mean, you don't have to do that to his book. Ojo-sama? So that means she's rich. Are the virgins from a noble family? Hmm. Guild operative Nathaniel Hawthorne. Apprentice Margaret Michel. Okay. <laughs> Dear Guild, who is this? Oh, is this the the leader of Port Mafia? You're going to give the location of. The agency? Mm. Guild assets. Oh. Okay. Science. Oh. Okay, I underestimated you. Is it already all planted in the in the sheep? Your true ability. Oh, so you're not hurt by your own creation. The ultimate geometry. What is it? Huh? Oh no! Run, run, run. Okay, so... I never expected this. I thought the Port Mafia would actually be targeting the detective agency first, but... They drew the first blood with the... The girl. Ah... Oh no! Are you guys going to get punished by your... by Francis? No mere prank. Yeah. That's so of you. Is it Akutagawa or Chuyo is gonna come here now? Okay. Your ability... looks pretty strong, so I get your confidence. Hmm. Even our elite. But it's not impossible. Who's you gonna send? Who are you gonna send? Chuya? My most eager. Akutagawa? It's nothing. Right? Yep. Oh god, please be okay. <gasps> ah! Oh, yeah, 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 I think he's sick, right? Oh god! He is... 
You better survive. There was no point. Are, are there really no backups? I mean, we do have lemon. Where is he? One word. Does I? Well done. Is that the word that you want? Compliment? Praise? <sighs> oh. He's relentless. He did belong for something. Oh dear. <gasps> you keep wounding yourself. What if you have blood loss or something? <sighs> oh god, that's such... The way they use ab their abilities is so dynamic, I really like it. More blood means more power to him! Uh. How many? Chuya! He looks so malicious. Oh, I'm so excited. I want to see his ability. I'm honestly itching for it. Because he's the top martial artist of Port Mafia. Oh, is this the... Eh? Your mother? I don't know, son. Oh, is this a member of Detective Agency? Francis. Oh. It is. You better report that. A bomb. They sent another one. Okay, so you're not in there. <laughs> oh god, Chuya, what's your ability? <gasps> okay, is that regarding, is that uh, about his abilities? Is that the cause? Oh, sensors. Mm. <gasps> Where's Zazai? Send out a living being. Will the president go? The gravity! Wow! That's a very, very powerful. <laughs> yeah, I want that as well. City folk, it's not about being a city folk or something like thing. It's just his ability. It's very nice. Oh. He looks like a vampire. Martial arts with gravity, huh? Yeah, but that's because he has あ、確かに探偵者がギルドを崩けば引けらは老せずして敵の力を削げる。あわよくば探偵者とギルド。いや、I <gasps> Rampo uses glasses. What did you find out? Yes. They fell for it. Mm. It must be the base of the de detective agency, right? They're gonna battle it out. Oh god. Abduction! They still? No! This is bad. 
ないね、残念ながら。No。こういう時は真実が一番聞く。<笑> oh dear。ボスの言葉だ。至急、事務員に避難指示を。国木田に繋げ。Oh God, the 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 leader of Bart Mafia is just too slick with his actions. Like, how can he even think of doing this? Like, he's just not gonna do a thing. I mean, he's going to sacrifice some pawns. Like the bomber, well, not exactly the bomber because I think he got away now. But the uh. Akutagawa is going to be sacrificed. I think he's sick. He's criti critically ill. I think he has this illness back then. Even before he got really injured by Atsushi, he got this illness that makes him cough up blood. So I'm thinking it must be some like something like a tuberculosis. So that basically means he's gonna fall through his death with time. His illness is just gonna get sicker. So I think uh, the part, the leader of Port Mafia. Mogi-san actually just decided, well, as long as you're still useful, I'm just gonna use the best of your ability, and then once you're done, I'm just gonna dispatch you or something, which I'm really, really afraid of. I'm just thinking. This is just a guess of mine. Uh, this is just something that I'm thinking of. So it's not like I'm saying that this is the cert. I'm not saying that this is certainly what uh the port mafia leader is thinking. I'm just. Thinking it's what he's thinking, okay? I hope you understand that. But yeah, um, but wow, the port mafia is really doing real well. I mean, they did really well. Uh, God, I mean, we've seen with other Saku that the port mafia leader can just sacrifice even the most valuable ability that they have in order to win the match or the win the war. He's gonna sacrifice some cities, some harbors, or what, as long as they can win the entirety of the. Match or rather of the war, right? So I'm really worried. Hopefully, uh, they have back up like Higuchi. I really want that bland here, uh, superintendent to come now because we clearly need all the help that we can get. Uh, we need to get uh Kutagawa out of there. Please, just get him out. I don't want him injured. Please, but yeah, um. I don't know what's gonna happen in the next episode. Margaret seems to be dead, or at the very least, critically injured. And Reverend uh, Nathaniel is also quite injured as well. They're basically in such major, or they critical. They have critical injuries right now. So I think hopefully the 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 war is done in that. But no, we're not gonna end the episode there. We are gonna have Chuya, whose ability I've been really really curious about since the first time we've seen him, especially because uh he was. That's his ex partner, so that probably means bef after Oda Saku because during Oda Saku's time, it feels like no, we haven't really seen Chuya in the flashback, right? So I'm really wondering when they actually partnered up. But uh, as Chuya said, he was a、uh, Dazai's partner, so I'm really looking forward to seeing what's gonna happen with this. But his ability is gravity, like oh gosh, if you actually pair that up with his. Since he's said to be the top martial artist of the Port Mafia, like that's gotta say something, right? So that means he's just that powerful. Like he's impenetrable. If someone comes near him, he's just gonna use the gravity to make them actually stop or what, and he's gonna do whatever. Oh God, that's such a useful ability. I mean, Margaret's weathering ability and the one where and Nathaniel's as well. They're just so very valuable abilities. Like we and the fact, I mean. I think this is the. I really like the battle between Nathaniel and Akutagawa because it's just so dynamic. Like, it's very flashy. I am. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm go not gonna deny. I really like those type of fight thing scenes. It's very flashy, right? And I'm so looking forward to seeing what's gonna happen with this because HP Love Heart, if I remember, or Low Heart. It's between those two. HP Love Heart and John is with. Is going to the office. I really thought they're gonna go with the underground base, but nah, they're not going there. They're just they're just gonna take hostages, which is such a oh god, that's such a cowardly、uh, decision. But in times of war, that's such a very very brilliant idea, right? So I'm wondering what's gonna happen with this, with with uh our ladies here be abducted or will Kunikita and 
the older brother actually managed to get, go there in time and and uh, how should I say this and actually save them. I'm really wondering where is Dazai and um what's the name uh, Atsushi are right now because we don't see them here. I'm really curious as to where they are because from Kunikida's words, it said he said that they're the closest, so that means they're far away. They're doing something else, so I'm wondering what it is. Maybe they're trying to find some more people to join them or what. I'm really curious. So yeah, um, all in all, this is such a fun episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm really looking forward to seeing what's gonna happen with this. What's Chiyo gonna do next? I'm really looking forward to that. So yeah, and what's gonna be Dasai's reactions once he figures this out? But yeah. Oh, before I actually end this, Akutagawa, he kept on saying that I'm suffering all this for one thing. I just want to hear one word, and I think from a certain person. And it's clear that the person is Dazai. I just don't know if, what kind of word does he want. He said word. It's not plural. So is it amazing? Or if it's plural, well done. You've done great. How should I say? He probably wants a compliment or praise or something. I'm just really looking forward to seeing more. I really want uh, Dazai and Akutagawa to talk it out. Based on the ending, I think they're gonna reconcile in this season. In this season, so hopefully that happens. Because clearly, Akutagawa's having this kind of time bomb in him. And they need to reconcile before his illness kick catches him off guard and dies. Or if he dies on battle. I don't know. Uh, I just see a lot of dead flags with Akutagawa right now. So I'm sorry about that. But yeah. Really looking forward to this. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye everyone.